welcome back. Now I have the ceiling fan up there. I'm not using the wireless microphone. So it's recording from the phone and it's an antique. All that together means you probably can't hear what the hell I'm saying. All right, guys, I'm back. Now, in an earlier vlog, I showed you a little bit about this story that I'm uh, putting together. It's a public domain work called The Adventures of Chatterer the Red Squirrel. And I'm creating an audiobook version with my music, which we don't have here. Whoop. Hello. Oh, that's a chapstick. Oh, you know what? I'm hearing smoother eardrums. Oh, at least feeling uh, smoother lips. Now, last time I showed you guys a little bit of the actual uh, book, uh, a little clip of the uh, what I've already finished so far. Chapter one. Chatterer the Red Squirrel runs for his life. Chatterer the Red Squirrel had been sulking well, because there was no excitement. Well, he had even tried to make some excitement. In any event, there's a little sample of the finished product. Now, what I'm doing here, that's part one. I have part one, part two. This is part three. And uh, last time in my last vlog, I showed you some of the finished stuff. What I'm going to show you now is actually editing, uh, which is basically, and just to give you a rundown in case you didn't see the earlier vlog, I should really have the more cool glasses. These aren't as strong, but they look cooler. So the way this works is I'm not British. Wow. And I'm not trying to fool a Brit because that's hard to do unless you're really good at accents. But what I'm trying to do is to do a halfway decent character or characterization of an older storyteller kind of a guy. And so a lot of what I do is uh, do takes over and over and over and over. And that's going to get a little repetitive here and you'll see that but you'll see how I knit this thing together. On the right here is something I've already uh, finished. Chatterer began to wonder what it would taste like. All right, so here's, but here's where we... It smelled good. It smelled good, too. It smelled good, too. Mm. So I have to also make a decision of what's going to work. It smelled good, too. And I do takes over and over and over, so. It looked good to eat. It smelled good, too. It smelled good, too. Oh, that could work. To eat. Good to eat. It smelled good, too. Well, that's good. That could work. It smelled good, too. And I'll make a, you can hear, see, I make a note to myself. That could work, meaning I'm going to do it some more, but we have one in the can that could be good enough. And usually I'll do more and then I'll, I'll do a better one. In that in this case, that's the one I'm going to use. That could work. It smelled good too. That's not bad. It smelled good too. The, the way I say good is too American though. It smelled good too. Good. 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 That's too American as well, but smelled good. Ooh. This sounds real American. Good. Good. No. Let's see if this good is better. It smelled good, too. I think that's a better good. It smelled good, too. But I'm not sure. Hmm. Well, let's take it. Let's, it's nice to have a little better context and to go back a bit more to see if that actually works well. Sometimes it'll sound like a really good reading, but one of the ones I thought was not as good works better with what you hear earlier. It's all about like mathematics. That looked good to eat. Inside was was something that looked something was something that looked good to eat. That looked good to eat. That's better. It smelled good too. That that works really well, but we want more space. That may be too much. So we'll find out once I get it all closer, you know. Was, was something that looked, was something that looked good to eat. I'd say the way I say was is just not quite perfectly British, but I, I'm going to live with it. 
inside was something that inside was something that looked good to eat. What I'll probably do is speed all of this up a little bit. Inside was something that looked good to eat. Better. Inside. That's all, that's a little faster. I just time compressed it. You probably saw it go like that. So I electronically sped the whole thing up a little bit. Anyway, you get the idea. But anyway, I think that's enough to share with the vlog. Thank you for watching. I'm going to try to not make these vlogs too long. I've been not keeping up with them every single day. And that was the idea is to do 30 days of 30 vlogs, you know. And what I'll do, it'll just, it'll just extend a little bit longer. But I think I still want to do 30 of them. And I'll just try to make them shorter. This one will end up being edited and it will take some time to do. And I'm going to try to make it easier on myself as I go along and do these. The goal of this, I want to uh, be on camera and get myself doing, I guess, what I feel I'm meant to do, which is entertain people and be on camera. I love being on camera. So to become more and more familiar with being on camera regularly and sort of force myself into getting away from them, just being on the microphone and actually Adding visualization. Visualization. Even if I don't speak correct English. Thank you. And on to vlog number eight, which will be something. Bye.